What's up guys, it's Tenkosh and we are back in Super Snail right now with the new upgrades and we got uh, 160k power for the summoning session we did in the last video. Some upgrades and now we can start spending that stuff. So uh, I've got the Assassin here and before fighting him I would like to change my equipment a bit. So this sword can be changed to the Assassination Sword, this one. That will allow us to do more damage against the Daily Hitman and maybe, maybe we will be able to overwhelm it. That's uh, the basic stuff that I just got and that will help me to do... Uh, good damage to Hitman. Um, let's challenge and see how it will go. So the first fight is always easy. The second fight is where we have the problem. Four rounds. There is a chance that we will make it. Because here if we intercept him we will get the Dragon Ball. And I want that for the next uh, summoning event. So uh, let's see the fight starts. And, oh my god it's taking so long. Uh, there is a chance. There is a chance we are doing decent damage. We managed. So um... Before the upgrade, I managed. I just managed to go through Hitman 19. So, uh, I say it was a good idea. It was a good stuff that allowed us to push forward. Now, I've got some guys from the mailbox. As you guys know, there are a lot of visitors here who are coming from time to time and really want to kick my ass. So, we will challenge them as well, because why the hell not? So, let's go one by one. Uh, this is the first assassin that was sent to us. It doesn't matter what weapon do we use here, I think. Uh, that's a nice stuff that we get for the reward. The problem is unskippable. I think we will win. I have a, a really good feeling. Oh, yeah, we will decimate this guy. So, uh, before that, I lost to all those fellas and now it feels that I'm way stronger and I can decimate them quite easily because the stat bonuses we've got are insane. We made a defeated. Alright, good. Ooh, we got this new railway, which is actually uh, not a railway. Battleship, the hell? Alright, let's challenge it. Probably we will lose here though. So I wanted to test everyone. Last time I was really bad uh, against everyone. So maybe we'll be able to go through someone. We are actually doing a decent damage and not being one-shotted. That's a good progress, but I think it won't be enough for this fight. So let's skip. Yeah. Still need to become stronger, but it's way better than it was before. Now uh, let's try Amelia. The mother of dragons uh, should be dead now because this... Weakness will not allow her to be strong and we will get 200 dragon chests. That's nice. And the crest, the relic. So, Amelia, what are you going to do about that? Oh, you are going to be defeated, I think. Yeah, she doesn't stand a chance. Defeated at round 13. Yep. Uh, goodbye. There we go. Relic obtained. Dragon medal. Nice. And now we got the wizard, so uh, say hello to this Schmuggle wizard boy, right? Let's go, ready to fight. <laughs> what the hell is this? Death Hello 7. Soul Offering Speed, that's actually pretty cool. Let's go. The wizard is weaker than us and yes, it will be decimated. I think it will be decimated. Usually when you fight the enemy and you get that blue um, auto-aim thing, that means that you are stronger and you will win, but sometimes you don't win. It's not guaranteed, but usually you're good. So there we go, we got another green relic and uh, some souls and everything. And now we got a daily agent that will just be defeated and we will get the rewards for that as well, because we need them for the relics too. They're pretty easy. I don't know, they weren't appearing for some time, but then they just just started rushing it i really don't know how it happened but it did happen so i'm okay with that so look at that we took out most of those guys i think we lost to the emperor and uh, basically i yeah, know that many of those guys are alive let's try this one as well so there we go chan he won oh one second i don't know half of him chan he let's go Ready to fight and we will probably lose as well because uh, it seems that we are weaker. We can't use our rush ability straight away. So, oh yeah, now this one will take forever to kill. Same with this spinning Excalibur sword guy. My god, I have no idea. We need like double effect to, in order to be able to use rush. So before that, I don't even want to attempt it. So what are those relics? Activate the red dragon egg. 
Okay. Let's upgrade it to the maximum as well. I mean, uh, I had this dragon in my inventory for a while. I don't know what it will do. And obviously, some help against the Dark Lord. I don't know who he is, but soul offering speed is nice as well. So let's go upgrade this one as well. Another agent uh, permit, which will give us attack per agent defeated. So no brainer. We got some extra power. That's nice. Now let's try doing some uh, um, exploration. Exploration. Digging challenges, basically. So this one can be exploited by our mechanics right now. But I think we won't be able to kill it. It should be very strong. Oh, we managed to defeat it. That's nice. We got the Unispark fragments. That's nice. And fusion dungeon cleared sewer base. What's that? Ancient coin per dig. That's nice. Let's see the second mainframe. Can be defeated as well. And we get a new game, which is unavailable. Rip. So I think we will... Yeah. Good. So as you can see, we are doing insane progress here. Clearing the dungeons will also allow us to upgrade the drill in order to get more ancient coins per digging. And that's really, really useful. So let's go inside. And newbies ready to fight now this guy will most likely keep me in the face oh yeah now this one is hard to kill although i can barely destroy some minions in the next dungeon and i think i can only defeat the first one the second will beat me up and let's see uh yeah they are doing way too much damage so yeah really close fight but in any case, we managed to do some progress here. And the weird thing that the next monster, the treasure monster, can be challenged. And I think we will be able to defeat it because... Because we can. The hell is wrong with the difficulty setting. Okay. And we got the new minigame. Love those. Yeah, the rest of the enemies are unbeatable for us right now. But I think the progress we did here is pretty decent as well. Now we get way more rewards from the digging. And uh, that will allow us to buy more stuff here earlier. Now I think we can switch the weapon back. Uh, I need to make the different presets. And uh, send our guy towards the exploration. So we are going to the Britland and... Uh, I'm almost ready to make a guide on this. This is a very complex map, guys. And uh, there are some things that are really slow here. For example, getting the silver for your ships. Let's go straight through all the areas so we can fight the boss. And I can show you how stronger we became. Like how many bosses can be killed just by... That's nice. Pickaxe. Uh, just by getting the upgrades we've got. Do we have any map upgrades? No. Intel? Maybe. Yeah, as you can see, I've got plenty of... Uh, bronze and gold coins and i am really low on the silver ones so yeah the fleet is here is doing pretty decent bonuses for us but that's not enough so now let's challenge nessie and see how it will go bam round the one defeated we didn't manage to dominate this boss beforehand and now we defeated it on round one that's how strong our equipment is and uh, the next boss let's see we should be able to take her out Round three, she's dominated straight away as well. My god. This is stronger than I expected. Now, Arthur. We didn't manage to defeat him. I think... We, oh, we didn't even get to him. We didn't manage to defeat Nelson. That's pretty cool. That will do some progress for our progression here. Alright, the normal enemies, they are kind of stronger than us. But we can take them out no problem because we are that good right now. Let's go. So we're defeating all the henchmen one after another. And oh... The Mr. Lancelot actually took us down, so we are way closer to defeating Arthur. Let's put it like that. Uh, Alright, now... Do we need to show to see something over here in the Mysterious Sea? Okay, I'll give you the hints before the next video. So, I almost managed to do the Pirate Paradise. There is one fight that I haven't finished and I'm going through Bibini Bottom. And we got a lot of stuff to play as well. And I think those unlock as you unlock new areas on the map. I'm not sure exactly. But it's taking quite a while and this is a very long-term progression. As your fleet will get better to get, become faster, but not that fast. Let's finish the para Pirate Paradise right now. I think with our newfound strength we can defeat the last enemy here. And, uh, yeah, let's see, should be somewhere here, there we go. The Swordsman in Black is the last man standing here. Challenge, let's go. No! Wow, 
That's pretty cool. This guy is strong. So, yeah, nothing else for seafaring skill. I've got some upgrades here, but I still have a lot to discover here. And yeah, basically don't have anything here. So let's convert. Finally, Britman... Finally, Britland is giving me good rewards. 471 instead of like 300 something. So that's useful now. By the way, guys, I grinded out Corio, So it's 100%. And that means only one thing. We can go to this area, to the museum. To the museum middle. And buy this thing when... Uh, no, not this. This one. So, uh, Corion postcard. Finally. I was waiting for it for so long. What will it do? That's a relic. Nice. And we get Yamato one as well. I wonder what do they do. Do we get Katai? Yes. Look at all that new stuff for us. America, not yet, but soon. And now we keep saving for this curator's helmet with 50k. Quite a lot. But we'll get there one day. So let's take a look at those relics. What do they do? They increase the museum middle output. That's pretty good. Let's upgrade them all. Oh, because we got the pieces of Unis Park, we can upgrade it. And this is the relic that's inside our compass. That means that it will allow us to become stronger in the fight because compass will be stronger. And that's actually... I have no idea. I've got way higher tier relics, but the bonuses from this one are so good that I don't want to change it for something else. So let's max it out again. Get more stats. And yeah, because uh, critical... Critical damage and uh, fire damage bonuses. I think they are really good. So now, next, oh my god, we got the uh, Lock Nessie Manager. All right, the boss that we just killed. Uh, let's fight it and see if it's oh, it's stronger than before. Look at those robots. They're so cool. I think we won't be able to defeat them right now. Let's see. Mm, probably not. They look too strong. Hell yeah, they are way stronger than we are. So we're basically doomed. They have half of their health. Goodbye. So what I want to deal with right now is this guy flying in the sky. Uh, back in the day when I just found him first, the guys in the command told me that I have to use incense to shoot him down. So let's do that. Let's fill this one fully and shoot in the sky. I've got plenty of incense. Come on. Let's go! Hell yeah. Well, let's see how it will end. You heard the scream from the yard. All right. Oh, nice. Object shut down. We got a whale warrior's head. Your fate is doomed. All right. School of Valor. Green relic, not bad. And 1,000 of those. Not that many. But at least we got the clear sky right now. And it's... It's way better. And that relic will give us attack again. Not bad. All right, that's like six attack per 1k times 20. Uh, that's 120 attack. Pretty decent, I should say. Let's install our new mini games. I guess the... Uh, we can install only one at a time. The new guide for mini games is coming soon when we'll get like four or five of those. But for now, PvP is our mini game. Let's uh, full equip with the gear. That's the best we can get. Uh, yeah, and the problem is, even with our newfound power, we can't move forward, so we are stuck here. No point trying someone higher level, because they will just decimate us. They got 4, 8 million, so no, thank you. All right, I found the mutant nerf core that we've got recently. Uh, we can't use it anyway. All right, what about the dragon egg? Right. Oh, we got the new dragon! That's so cool, the new minions. And yeah, we can clone them, but they are pretty weak right now because we don't get the dragon tier, so yeah, but it's nice to have new type of minions. Now, the most important question, how far we can push in the gene simulation with the newfound power? Let's press quick clear, we were at 2, uh, 822, so now we will push forward and uh, we will see where we will stop. I don't think that it will be fast, it will take a while, I hope. So, I think I'll just skip to the part where I will die. There we go, we got defeated. And take a look at the amount of power we will get. What, 2k only? That's weird. Uh, we were at 822, now we are at 858. So, that's like uh, 30, 46 levels. Oh my god, that's insane. 
I think this thing is a bit broken. It should give us more power for that. Oh, well. 2.3. That's actually pretty good. But we also got other G simulations, so we'll do those as well for extra gains, extra power, and extra cells. And yes, guys, we are plowing through our copies like it's paper. It's very nice. Ooh! The last one beat us, but we're getting even more power right now. Let's go in other modes. There we go for the angel mode. We are stuck at 194. Everything else requires a higher tier of our hero. Reshaping. Come on. I want to try something new here. Hell yeah. We finished the book demon trial. Offering speed up. Expert scroll. That's it. Uh, okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Don't, don't, don't. There we go. Full gear. Let's try. Hell yeah, tigers are going out. That's nice. What are we getting for this? We are getting some uh, tadpoles. That's nice. And the most important, we get the power. There we go. We managed to defeat five of those. But uh, that's 50% of them. We got more challenges here that we can try to take. Basically, our power is almost as those copper bear gene trials. I don't remember where I've got them. And they defeated me in one shot. Okay, what about this guy? Uh... Yeah, they're stronger. Probably won't be able to fight them. But yeah, that allowed us to get uh, plenty of power right here. And we get the training bonus as well. Oh, nice. And we got the postcards that we can share and get uh, white tadpoles and some lottery tickets. Okay. By the way, guys, I don't share useless stuff on my social media. So uh, check out my TikTok, Twitter, and whatever, Facebook or anything. The links are in the video description. So you can watch my other content over there as well. And my other YouTube channels. So there we go. We shared everything. That's nice. That's some extra stuff for us. We get 50 more lottery tickets. I'll just draw them off camera because I'm pretty sure I won't get anything good. But um, maybe I'll get something. I'll show you that kind of stuff. Yeah, that was pretty useless to be honest. But we've got some scrolls that we can open and maybe upgrade the relic. Hmm. We got a me mantic chest. Mimetic. Mimetic. Let's see, what do we get this time? Flawless school, coating green sea fungus. Okay, so what does it do? Uh, HP and sieve, some stats, let's go. We upgraded it to the blue one, and then we get the mutant form bonus afterwards, so I'll just leave it as it is right now. I don't really invest in them yet, because I'm not sure what's the best way to do that. If you get tips on how to actually go with that, uh, let me know in the comments, because I'm still last in that area okay the next thing i wanted to do in this video is progress my gene evolution research whatever because uh, i really want to unlock the new form i want to progress but it takes forever to do the research we've got 13 days of that research saved up so now we will rush it um how do we rush it at first, I will do the upgrades that matter. For example, I don't have that many demon cells. And uh, the demon cells that will give me the bonuses here are pretty good. And they take forever. Oh my god. But that's a compass upgrade. That means that uh, we are getting the power straight away. Hey, that's the last tier. Nice. Uh, can we do the fast research here no we cannot so i will just get my stats here while i have the demon cells and when i don't have them anymore i will move on to the next area angel genes now here we got ooh, plenty same stuff quick research oh wait that's not efficient there we go so much better so yeah we will be rushing uh troop attack in order to get the compass bonus as well there we go all compass effects plus 40 so they will multiply i think or at least add up, so that will be nice. And that will make us way stronger again. And I wonder, can we press upgrade everything somewhere here? Like, I want to max out everything. No? No. Okay. For other modes, I will go with the stats that will allow me to get uh, stats for myself. Oh, wait, we can get to tier 5 with zombies today. Hmm. So, yeah, we're going fast. We're going strong. Yay, zombies are stronger. Completed. Nice. And we can go for zombie ritual 5. Quick research again. Uh, we don't have the speed ups anymore. I thought I would be able to push way more, but we spent 13 days really fast here. 
I hope it was worth it. Let's see what do we get. Claim all, no rewards available, so we have everything that we could here. Here, no rewards available. A DNA bonus, here, okay. So let's get that, and then we can buy some stuff. Uh, I think I will. I think I will, guys, because I really need those cells, and they're really hard to come by, and I've got way too many uh, W tadpoles, so I will buy that stuff. And we unlock the zombie ritual 5 because of that speed up that we've got, or not. No, because we need to analyze it. My god, it takes forever. I'm glad that my uh, demon and uh, angel are leveled up already. So the details, explore Koryu and find Pusan virus, so we gotta replay that again, my god. Defeat the virus and obtain Gene Sigmund. Clear the ultimate... The hell is this? Everything else is done, but those first three steps are like, what? So how much power did we get from all that? Not that much. Overall, we got 150k today. Because um, we started at 2.1 million before the summons. Then we got to 2.25 uh, to something. And now we are 2.4. So we are progressing. All right, we got the super treasure map. And what do we get? Ooh, Hubble telescope. Is it good? I don't remember. No, it's not. <laughs> All right, I was expecting to get something cool out of th that stuff, but no. And we got another small upgrade, but it will be really useful for us. The loaves that will be used in the compass as well. So that will mean more stats for our compass. Let's upgrade it a bit more. That will give us more stats but from the upgrade. And also uh, more stats from its being, well, stronger. And basically the last thing I wanted to talk with you about today is the rocket. Because here, well, uh, I wasn't really progressing that much. I'm stuck in the last area of um, of the second uh, map, I think. Uh, those guys are just decimating me. Uh, yeah, we're almost done here. So uh, rem I remember the first map and it was really tiresome. But right now we're stronger. We might be even... No, we don't have enough power to cut the bamboo. So probably we're not ready to fight the boss as well. Let's try to defeat whatever we can. Uh, we need to get the stone. Which stone? Not sure. But yeah, let's fight those guys here in the end and see how it will go. Challenging works so we can defeat them no problem. No problem, my... Uh -huh. Yeah, that's not that easy. We barely, barely take them out. My god, why they are so tough? Uh, here we need special relic that we don't have. That's interesting. For the Panzer, Sasaki. Alright. Uh, uh, let's see. Can we triumph in the duel against him? Yes, this one is easier. Alright. For the last seal stone, we need the relic with sieve higher than 88. And we don't have one. The highest we have is 86. So yeah, probably not so much. But we can defeat the guy before the boss because we got the units upgraded and we have the low casualties here last time i didn't manage to beat him so let's go bam traveler 617 something is defeated we lost only four of our minions and uh, i guess we now have to fight against him triumph in the duel probably won't work obviously because we can't defeat everyone in the map let's see how far away from winning this we are okay, we will be able to do this pretty soon, but uh, yeah, in order to fight the actual blood and the last main... Oh, we can do this, alright. Let's deploy more units so we'll have lower casualties. Attack. Bam. Uh, nice, we got some losses here, not that many again. But, look at that explosion. So what now? Enter the helmet. Who's in We got the doggo inside. This is hilarious. Alright. But the doggo isn't as easy as it seems. We need a pack of 63 in order to fight it. Uh, otherwise, yeah, it will be hard. But yeah, judging by the commands, we need about 3 million power to clear it. So, yeah, I don't even want to try it. Oh, okay. For the sake of the video, I will. So, we will see how far I am from defeating it. Challenge now, let's see. That's a cute doggo, I like it. Oh! Obviously, I need to defeat all the guys around it that will give me the relic that will make me stronger against him. Because right now, uh, it's, it's, it's not working. 
And as for the galaxies, I can't truly really do anything right now. Because I still lack the basic stuff for this one. So I need this uh, singularity crystal, which I can't really get anywhere right now. And yeah, basically we can get it only from the nebula chest and special rewards, but... Yeah, I opened a bunch of those and got nothing so far. So yeah, I don't know. What's the chance of getting it? 1%. I guess I'm really unlucky, but uh, yeah, we wait. And yeah, I think that's ever... Oh, why this one is marked right now? Ooh, we can upgrade the Bled and Throne again. Let's go. That will allow us to get a bit more oomph. Nice. Even more resources. And I like the uh, museum output and demon bonuses. So it's pretty nice. Uh, we are almost at 2 million. Uh, 2.5 million. Close. We got the relic from the cat room. The hell was that? I'll show it to you in a second. Let me get... Other rewards, if they are available, I can't find any. Take a look at that. We got Atomic Cloak. That's not that nice. I mean, it's average relic. But still, it's a free relic that will give us the bonuses. So, why not? And yeah, guys, at this point, I think we are pretty much done for today's playthrough. Because there are not many things I can show you outside of what I showed you already. Uh, yes, I need to make the Britland guide. I'm almost ready for it. But I really want to go a bit further to unlock all the ships, to unlock all the areas, to know what to expect from the store. Because right now, uh, with this store, I don't think it's a good time to make a guide because I haven't unlocked everything yet. I know some tips, but if you get extra tips for a Britland, let me know down below in the comments, that will help. Just as any other of your comments will help to promote the video in YouTube algorithm together with likes and subscriptions. So do all that if you can, I will be really grateful. And you can check out the video description for additional links. We got the LD players, we can play this and other Android games on the PC. Playlist with other videos for Super Snail, my other YouTube channels, social media like TikTok and Facebook. I post short videos over there. Pretty fun, I hope. And other useful stuff. Other than that, guys, thank you very much for watching. That's about it for now. Stan Kosh out. Have a good one. Bye.